Alright, we are now on part 9 of the Swordless Run through the first Legend of Zelda for the NES. Here's where we're going to hit kind of a snag, though. We're not going to be able to just complete the fourth dungeon. Instead, we got to have either the sword or the wand in order to beat the boss of that dungeon. I'm not going to be using the sword, so that means we got to go get the wand from the sixth dungeon. But in order to get the wand, we have to have the bomb upgrade from the fifth dungeon. And all that kind of good stuff. But I am going to go to the fourth dungeon before I do all that. I'm going to get the ladder, and then I'm going to go to the east coast of the world map and get the two heart containers that I'm missing. And I'll probably end this part after I get the two heart containers, but until then we'll go ahead and get the ladder and whatnot. Then after that I have to farm money for bombs and the bomb upgrade in the fifth dungeon, which will cost a hundred for the bomb upgrade. I'm also going to try to get the whistle while I'm in the fifth dungeon, but if I don't it's no big deal. That's not important right now, but if I get it then very cool. And uh, after we get the bomb upgrade, I'm, I gotta go to the 6th dungeon and get the wand, and then we'll come back here and kill the boss. <coughs> I don't think the ladder's too deep into this dungeon. I'm gonna get all the keys while I'm on my way through. Light up the room real quick. And then I'm just gonna try to run underneath all these guys. Or run around them, one of the two. Alright, good. Light up the room again. I'm gonna try to kill these guys for profit and money right quick. Twelve right now. Fifteen. Profited by three rubies. I'm pretty sure it's to the right of here. kill off all these guys. <clears throat> kill the <clears throat> kill the bat part of them with uh, the boomerang and get them to transform into the bat with the arrows or the candle. And then be sworn by fifty thousand bats. Oh well they're easy to kill anyway. And the ladder should be in this room. Oh god, like likes. Um, paralyze him and try to pummel him with arrows, I guess. Two, three, four, five arrows to kill him. One, two, three, four, five. Alright. Now I'll just kill him with the candle since I ran out of cash and I don't got bombs. Oh boy. Well, at least we got the ladder. After I get it, I'm going to leave and go to the east coast and get the two heart containers that I'm missing from the overworld map. And then I'll go ahead and end this part. Shouldn't take that long to get there and whatnot. Especially since we got the ladder, you can just walk right through rooms like this, for the most part, unless they get in your way. Not even going to worry about lighting the room up. Stun them and walk around them if you need to. Or let them jump onto you. Almost out. Down one more room, I think. Pretty sure. Yep. Time to head east. After I get these two heart containers all. I've gotten every hidden heart container on the overworld map. The only other heart containers I can get are from the from the dungeon bosses. Keep moving east. Should be just through the desert area and whatnot. Try to get. I'm <clears throat> gonna try to get a little bit of cash while I'm going there, cause I'm gonna have to have quite a bit for that stupid bomb upgrade and getting bombs and whatnot. Heal up right quick. Well, at 
least I'm getting a little bit of cash. Take the warp real quick. Alright. I'll just head out east from here. Not that far. Just keep following where I'm at now until I get to a dead end, then go north and just you'll see one in plain sight and the other. You have to take a raft too. Yeah, whatever. Run into it. Oh, he almost did. Turn and go north here, and uh, yeah, we'll be there in just a second. Would eat that heart to gain its courage, Future Rum. That's how Link gets the Triforce of Courage, if y'all didn't know. I mean, think about it. What does he do to every boss that he kills? He eats their hearts to gain their courage. Anyway, I know that's not really how it works, but it's just kind of funny. And this is the other heart container. And well, that's it for part 9.